Hi guys, um, it's me again. I told you I'd update you right now. I'm on the ice pack. I am hurting pretty bad. Um, just kind of a toothache right now, but as the pain medicine's wearing off, let me tell you that pain is kicking in from this thing. It's not very, very painful, but it is uncomfortable. Uh, I tell you what, it hurt really bad when he hit the spot. Uh, he hit kind of sort of right where the pain was. Uh, it wasn't the fastest shots that he did. He decided to do what is called a sacrolic joint injection. S-A-C-R-O-I-L-I-A-C. -I joint injection. And where this is, is um, basically... If you're looking at one of them figures of a spine, it comes down and of course mine's in the lower lumbard region and then like off to the side, you kind of got where your hips go. So you're going to have that little triangle and then where the hips go and all that is right near the uh, S1 um, 4-5 S1 or S5 however it went um so anyway he did the injections in there what it is if you had an epidural injection it's just like that it's not really too too bad they inject numbing medicine into you at first and then he gets in there with the main needle and basically st uh, sticks in like a steroid and it's like a steroid stuff that they inject in there with a little bit of numbing medicine and everything um, I will tell you that it caused my back to really go in muscle spasms um, but all in all it wasn't that bad um, you're not allowed to drive after the shots are done what is it um, no work, no driving, and no alcohol consumption the day of the procedure. You may resume uh, full activity the following day. We ask that you keep yourself well hydrated. Um, but that is how my doctor does it. Your doctor may do it a little bit different. Um, I was just nervous going in because I've had so many complications with surgeries and everything. Uh, I mean, if this is something that you're interested in doing that you think that will help you, uh, I would honestly suggest doing it. It wasn't a bad procedure. Yes, any procedure is very dangerous. And I know that it is not a permanent fix. But... The surgery wasn't a permanent fix either, um, which was supposed to be, and actually made my back hurt worse. Um, they did change my pain medication, um, and uh, he, hopefully that will work. Um, the shot is supposed to give release, relief like somewhere between five to eight months supposedly I don't know I've never had it we'll have to wait and see how it goes I am to continue therapy but that is what is going on with me I am no doctor I cannot tell you what to do I will however update you on whether it does give me relief they do suggest height or heat afterwards whatever feels better to you um right now the heat is or the cold is making my legs kind of achy um but that could just be because i just did the dishes um um but they had to be done i was gonna do them this morning before i went but that didn't happen um the procedure wasn't bad now in my facility you go in and it's similar very similar to an operating room um i'm sure there's videos on it actually i know there's videos on the sacral 
black joint injection because I have it pulled up here on the internet. Internet. Um, it actually says the sexolic. I can't say that word, so I'll just say that word. The that word joint lies next to the spine and connects the sacrum with the hip on both sides. There are two that word joints uh, one on the right and one on the left. Joint inflammation and or dysfunction yeah dysfunctionation in this area can cause pain and then it says read more about it. Again you spell that word S-A-C-R O I L A C joint is what it's called. Um, they just uh, like have a like x ray machine over top of you, and you kind of lay down on the table. And if you've had an epidural injection, like I said, it's just like that. You're going to lay down on the operating table and they kind of talk to you. Um, and it really wasn't that bad. But I wish that, you know, maybe this would have worked prior to me getting the surgery. But um, we'll see what happens, he says. Hopefully everything goes well. Um will know the next few days and of course I will keep you updated I will start posting videos probably Monday Wednesday and Friday um, if as things progress uh, they do want me to continue with physical therapy and that's working pretty good uh, I believe I said that in the last vi uh, video but that's all I got for you guys. Um, this is where I am. Um, hopefully, you know, you guys can, you know, go down this road and get some relief as well. Um, but leave me some comments down there below. Um, also, I, if I do anything or can do anything... I always put my back brace on that does help give me support um, when I am outside you know even if just I'm walking because it just really helps I don't wear it a whole lot because it does um, take it to where you don't want to like tighten your core muscles and everything but I have put on so much weight since I hurt my back and I, I don't know if anyone else has. But um, leave me a comment down below if you've had these injections and if so, how yours went. And uh, I'd just like to know that uh, it's, it's not this minimum amount of us out here and uh, that of my friends that, you know, I'm aware of that have had this surgery. But, um, you know, leave me a comment down below. We'll get a little group going and uh, I will update you on, uh, let's see, we'll go ahead and do our next video on Friday. Unless there's any changes, I will do a short video. Um, give me a thumb up, thumbs up if you like the video and comment down below and we'll see what's going on oh and just a heads up my son you know i love to vape i really do like to vape i'm i i prefer a uh, zero nicotine but he bought me a new mod um not sure if you can see that or not or, or even interested in this if not uh, click out but it's called the e-leaf and I tell you I love this thing it, it's really nice um, 
and it is just so convenient um gives you great flavor and everything but we're past the 10 minutes like i said if you didn't want to hear that last little bit i'm sorry about it um leave me some comments down below i will um i don't know maybe i'll start another channel and and do something a little bit of this and that type videos um but let me know what y'all think think thank you